Well, hello, my dear friends, and welcome back to another video of our Mortar campaign in Third Age Fighting Conquer version 5. Before we jump into this battle, I want to do some uh, um, announcements and some things to say. So, first of all, there should not be an echo anymore. I did some test runs with the audio, and it should be fine. So, here's hoping. Second of all, this video will go live on the 7th of September. Which, uh, and by the time that this will go live, it means me and my fiance will be married because we our wedding is on the 7th of September. Um, if you guys could, you know, just show your love and just show your, show your support for us in the comments and by liking and subscribing, that would just mean a lot to me. Um, and yeah, I hope um, to have a great day. Currently, I'm recording this on Tuesday. And the weather forecasts are quite ridiculous. They are giving like 31 degrees Celsius, which is kind of warm for this time of year. Um, but at least no rain, so we'll have a great time, I hope. Um, so yeah, um, by the time that this video is live, I am married. I'm a married man. I'm. I cannot wait. I'm. I'm beyond excited for Thursday. Um, but that's it for today for the announcements kind of things. So we're going to jump in into this huge battle against General Tathar over in uh, where is this called? What's this settlement the region called? It's called the Lands Lands of the Poros, and it's a big battle. You know we've got a good army. He has a mediocre army to be fair. How many arches does he have? He doesn't have any arches, does he? No, that's kind of, kind of good. He does have a lot of cav. We have a lot of anti-cav units. And he does have some uh, coastal wardens and Lebanon marines. But overall, I think this should be a comfortable win. So let us jump into it. <clears throat> so yeah, it's also... I'm recording this on, th on Tuesday not evening. Um, which means... It's still quite warm, actually. It's still like 27 degrees, and the room I'm recording is in is quite warm as well. Um, so I hope to not have to deal with it too long. But you know, I'm, I'm fine. I'll be fine. Um, these guys will take the front row of the fighting. Okay. And all oh, these guys can go away for a second. Then these guys can take on this flank. These guys can take on this flank. Archers can go behind. Of course. What else is new? I think it's basically always the same, isn't it? And I'm also going to place these guys behind. Just like spread out a bit so they can cover where necessary. And then over here we'll place the uh, extra infantry. And over on the left we will place the cav. Like that. Okay, and then this guy, these guys can go control one. All of these guys then go. Okay, yeah. We are in a good position now. Move up a bit. Move the calf. Let let us get a good victory here for a married man Peter. <laughs> they have no archers. They have no siege equipment. So they have no ranged capabilities besides their coastal wardens, which we should be able to deal with quite easily. Are they coming towards us? Can't see from this far away, to be fair. No, they're not. In that case, I'm gonna have to move up a bit. I'm gonna have to move my forces up a bit. Oh, we're of course attacking, so it's not crazy that they're not um, it's a, they're coming forth, but it's, you know. Yeah, it's just, yeah. 
we've been getting some nice support the last episode. You know, some very nice comments. Of course, Nikos is always there with his loyal commenting, which I very much appreciate, Nikos. Um, and also, someone also commented saying, like, um, you're so underrated and I hope you get more subscribers, which is very nice, of course. Thank you very much for that, guys. I don't have my phone with me at the moment to check uh, who that exactly was, but you know who it was. The person who said it, he knows. He or she knows. Come on, we do want a bit of... Say, want to stay a bit on this side of the... Height. Okay, they sh we should be triggering, or triggering them to come forward, right? We're not in archer range yet, though. I don't want them to get tired, because that's pro that would be a problem. So don't want to. Okay, this should be enough. This should this should really f heavy calf, heavy calf, heavy calf, and light some light calf. Come on, guys, come on. Yeah, you are repositioning your troops. Does that mean you're thinking of an attack? Or just doing it for fun. Because usually they do that before they move forward. Which is not the case this time, sadly. My god. Um, this might be a bit too far. We'll just do it anyway. But it should see our archers in range. Yes, okay, good. Then this is exactly the position we want. Hey. These guys were in range, it said. They're moving away! How annoying! Why are they doing this? Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna ask them to run anymore because I don't want to, them to tire out. Just move them. They're getting trapped into a corner, which will mean that they can run away. Which is not something we want. Oh. Run, run, run. Because they are not... Okay, they're, they're attacking now. That's good. They're moving forward again. Start firing. Huh. Seems like we're gonna have a big calf battle on this side, so that means I'm gonna move those guys over. You, I want you to change. Ch um, my looking knob rim can do that. Oh, what? Good. Get rid of the general, please. Come on, guys. Okay, you guys get in there. What's happening over here? They're routing? No, they're not, okay. Yeah. 
You get in there. I'm not quite sure why these guys are all so weird. Doing so weird, to be fair. What's happening? Okay, you just need to get rid of him. Where are you? You get rid of those guys. We are doing quite well so far. See, there goes their general. Awesome. Great, 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 great. That will definitely s turn some guys to run. Um, now we're going to have to make use of that advantage to... Who are you still fighting? Uh, we are taking about 10% damage. That's not that great. Okay. Um, okay, let's see. What we can we charge? Yeah, charge more into the back of these guys. Okay, great. Get get back. You get rid of those guys. Actually, let, let's him take care of those guys. Hey, And we're already at 81%. Ninety-five, ninety-seven. that's enough. And how much did we lose? Eh, about 10, 12%. That's not that bad. Who killed the most? Black Uruk Halberts. Very nice. Very nice. Very nice. Is there anyone who is less than the 100 dudes? No. White girl right there, my friends. Definitely a, a very good... Very good ep uh, battle. Man, why am I searching for my words there? Ooh, execute them all. Look at that. Barely lost this, lost any dudes. And this army is going to go to Tiridoros, which doesn't have. That much men in there? No, we can easily take them. Uh, for that, we could bring some, but we're already gathering troops uh, here again, so. Um, we're moving more troops, weren't we? These, these guys have all moved? Yes, they have. Oh, yeah, the great beasts were coming as well, right? Yes, they are. Uh, and I'm going to train a new army over here in the Moranon with Gan Altan, who I've taken out of uh, Gelebrin, because I don't think he needs defending, to be fair. Um, and we're going to go for the ring. I think the last time the ring was somewhere in Dorwinian. I think it was over here in Lest. Or in Mistrand, I don't know. So yeah, we are doing that. Uh, these guys are of course getting a unit. That's good. We're still under siege in Brethel, but we're gonna do the same thing as last time. Okay, I think that's an end turn then. Come on, move your troops a bit faster, my friends. Ooh, they do have a lot of troops still. Elfir is still alive. That's pretty good. He never, he, he doesn't regularly survive. 
Okay, so that's Cor Corion. Not really th threats, I would say. The guys that are there together. Plargir is, of course, still very much well defended. Brethel. Will we get the Brethel for that now? or No, nope, we will not, it seems. No. Nope. That's fine. Let us see what awaits us in this new turn. Brawler Spith in Brethel awaits us, apparently. Put those guys all, all, all over there. He's going down here. Train those units. Get your asses a moving. Great beasts also have a lot of more uh, range, it seems. Which is good. We'll find a watchtower right there. No, no, no. Just, just stay in here. Oh, stay in there. Oh yes, daddy. Give me all those juicy troops. Well, that means I have a lot of less money left, but that's fine. Dominion camp over there, sure. Okay. Just gonna stand over there menacingly and wait for backup. Where is my spy? Didn't I have some around here? Yes, he is here. So he has nothing. And they have some good art. One, two, three, four. They got some good archers. They got some cav. Nothing I couldn't beat. But they are sending in more reinforcements. So we're definitely going to need that second army, I feel. What are we doing over here? Okay. We already have the barracks here, maybe. Or, no. We need the slave quarters for that then. Okay. They're gonna attack us on the next turn. These troops are shite. Even though these guys are a bit better, they will, they will easily survive that. Um, I don't think I, I don't need any defenses here because Khan uh, uh, holds them both, so that's good. That's my spy. Spy, please. Need to be able to see what's coming for me. Sakal Thor. Oh, we should actually get. He's all the way over there. <laughs> Yikes. Um, can we train a diplomat anywhere over here? Spy. Spy. Diplomat. Yeah, send him to um to trade or to talk with the Ranheim. Because I'd rather have those guys on my side than fight them in this battle. To be fair. Mm -hmm. That's another end turn, I think. Irk Estelots, what can we get there? Nothing major, I'd say. No, no, nothing I really need, to be fair. Care Andros, however. Get me that. I think we're building over here. No, West. They're not building anything. We have any everything maxed out? Yes, that's great. Let's get them a uh, chieftain's hall then. Can we already start training? No. Guard barracks then. Mm, already everything maxed out here except the walls, of course. Um, blacksmith. Need to be building in all my frontline settlements, guys. So that I can easily train. A lot of troops at the front line. Okay. Get ready for fighting. So he's gonna he's gonna go be able to go around there. So let us make sure that we have our army prepared for him. Uh, 
So like that. Then we want these dudes. Then all of our pikes, which aren't a lot. Then all these dudes, which are a lot. Archers. And ballistas. And then he can take control of that army in the next turn. Great. We're going to have another defensive siege battle there. Which we should be able to win. And the turn again. Ta -ta -ta. Hey, come on. Move a bit faster, guys. Come on. Oh, he's also sending Baron down there. Yeah, it'll be a while until we can able to be able to push down against uh, Tarnost, I think. We definitely need to take Fanyland, uh, Tiridoros, Paradhan, and Linhir first, I'd say. So then we can have a border at Linhir with uh, Dol Enroth. Not quite sure what he's up to. Okay. So, we're outnumbered, but they have crappy troops. And we have Blessed Towers. And good archers. So easy peasy lemon as go easy for us. Ah, I still have some iced tea. Mm. Like it, like it a lot. Oh, the wall is still damaged there, okay. I didn't look, did they have any ballistas? Mm. Okay, no, they don't, that's good. Okay, so all of our pikes. Mm, one more pike unit. Then these guys on the wall over here. And these guys can take the wall over here. These guys can take the walls over there. And really spread out if you can. As far as you could. Why why are you not doing that? Okay, well that's I don't think it's far enough, but oh, that should activate both towers, that's good. Okay. Um Definitely those guys in a mix as well. I think I'm going to put those guys here as well. Maybe to activate that tower. Because I think they're going to come in somewhere closely. Um, I think I'm going to send my calf over through this way. And then we have the only the blisters left. Which we can put over here. If we can, if we have to. You get over there. Okay. Um. So these guys can take the front again. Because these are really good troops. Sorry, didn't mean to get them off. Then one, two, one, two, three. Okay, continue the battle. Guys, there's a lot of letters. Try to get them off those letters. Okay, they're not they're not going anywhere around there, so that's good. I 
as I predicted. They are putting the ladders over there. Oh, those things are not gonna make it at all. I love it. But oh, this one is going down. The enemy are battering down the gates. Hmm. What are these Gondor militia? Oh, poor, poor sods. Okay, let some of them get on the wall and now attack them. Are they on their... No, they're not good. Okay, they're going through the gates. Good luck with that. Already killed 11%. And, oh, nice. Those guys are down. These guys are snoveling. We're dying, as we sh as I should say. I'll just keep firing, whatever. Okay, wait. Can I get some firing over here, perhaps? Should be able to fire on those guys. Would be interesting to see if they can actually hit them. Are they gonna fire? Oh, yeah. Oh, that was a good hit. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Izzy, for showing me that spot. I think it was actually Izzy as well. Oh, they're dying. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, stop it now. This should be... Uh, get them as well. Oh, no. oh, I hope that doesn't mean that we're gonna crash. Come on, a couple of more ballista bolts in there. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. That killed a lot of them. Oh, and they're routing. Good. Stop firing. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. Okay, and now we just have the gu guys that are there. Left. And they are not posing much of a threat. Not at all. I have lost half their men. You know what? Get your get your asses down here. Oh wait, we've we've got the calf for this, of course. They run down as many as we can. Ah. Oh. Don't necessarily want to uh, unnecessarily kill my own troops, so. If we continue like this, we will smash the enemy. What are they doing? They're not coming in. No, they're not. Okay. Interesting. That's interesting tactics. And by tactics, I mean lack thereof. Let's just move those guys out.
very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Just get in there, dudes. So many percentages. I'm not quite sure what what the where our deaths come from so much. Come on, make them route. Finally, kill those last dudes. Not quite sure who took the most casualties then, but apparently we took 16% casualties. Huh, 14. Hmm. Who killed the most? Logambrim, Southron Warband, Orc Maulers. Oh, yeah. Ballista? How much did they kill? Other Ballista? What? Did they not kill anyone? That's not... Oh, okay. 41. I was like, what the... But apparently we have three ballistas in this army. I did not know that. Learn something new in the free day. Oh, yeah. So now we should be able to get some reinforcements in the settlement. If we are not immediately attacked again. Which uh, would suck. Good. Good, good, good. And with those kept, uh, that, uh, those reinforcements that Captain Luckduff brings, we should definitely be, um, quite unstoppable in Brethel, to be fair. Because we all then have trolls. Um, yeah, give me that, even though I don't have money. Okay, let's see. I'd, I'd rather keep those guys, to be fair. These guys are all still fine as well. Send this calf, these calf units back. And those dudes. How much space do we have now? Four. How much do we need? A lot. <laughs> They're not that great either. Don't need that many ballistas as well. Three more spaces. Definitely the trolls. And one of those. Would like some more archers as well. To be fair, these guys can go back then. And then... Yeah, not much else to be fair. These, those guys can just stay back there. Like some more archers. When we can. Which we are training. There. And there. And there. The good the good archers. The or, uh, or the better archers, I should probably say. Oh. Get you there. Ooh. Oh yeah. I am definitely fighting this, guys. The battle for Tirithoros. <laughs> okay. Well, we've got one army bef in front of us. I mean, army can, can barely call that an army.
These guys can take a flank. Oh, wait. Um, that's not what I meant. Okay, I'll do it like this then. These guys who can take the front. These guys can take that flank. Then all oh, these 42 troops can take this flank. Archers behind. These guys can go there. Silence will, but behind the archers, so we can move them in when necessary. We've already got those guys, and then on this flank we will put the cav. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. We need to make sure we have defeated these guys before the enemy arrives. The, the second army arrives. So we can just deal with the calf, with our calf. Then we can turn around and take this hill on them. Which will be awesome. Should have probably saved after the last battle because it was a bit buggy at, the, at one sec. Yeah, good charge them. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Hey, you what? Rush forth to deal with those guys, please. I'm not quite sure how their charge did so much damage, but it might just be me. Okay, good. Those guys are routing. Also get those guys in there. They're killing so many of my infantry. What the hell? Or my cav, I mean. Oh, that's their unit. Okay, okay that's their general. Good. Okay, so that's one army done. Oh, no, what? No, no, no. Okay, then turn around. And prepare for the other army. Yeah, you pursue those last troops. Please make sure you kill that dude. Come on. And he should be dead. Yes, okay, good. Guess we can put one calf unit on this side as well. Okay, we now have a very good position over on this hill. Killed 12% of their army already. Did they have any ballistas? No, not as far as I can tell. They do have some good archers this time. So we do need to wor worry about that. They also have some peanut gallon cav, which could also prove to be a problem, because they are quite good. Good, we're already are firing. These guys are all warmed up again. Or 
We're gonna take some air, uh, damage from their archers, which is fine. Move them around. Okay, I've got two troops of Cav over that's on this side. So we need to make sure we can get rid of them. Oh, you move away. And okay, charge them now. Fucking hell. Okay, get out of there, get out of there. Okay, do we have some infantry? Uh, yes, okay, get, get your asses in here. The battle is very much in our favor. Victory will be ours. Okay. I think we're gonna have to commit all of those guys there. Get you in there. Get you in there. Plug those holes, guys. Plug them. Plug them real good. Come on, you get rid of those lost calf dudes. Come on. Okay, so just send all of those archers against those guys. Move you guys across there. Man. These guys are being proving to be a tough nut to crack. Yes, get rid of their arch, the, their cav, I should say. Oh. Okay, get out. Kill their calf. Come on, kill their general, I mean. Do not let him get away. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Not geezers. Okay. Really? I'll let them charge through the one gap, huh? Kill the general! Oh my god, okay. Um. Might as well make yourself useful there. Okay, this is absolutely batshit crazy that these guys are not dying. Okay, good. Run away. Do that again. This time a bit more convincingly. Finally! Fucking hell. Charge those guys in the back. Ah, they're they're dying by the bushels, yes. Need to make sure every last one of those guys are dead. I mean, not necessarily every last one, but at least both the armies should be dead. Okay. Eighty-eight percent. That's definitely not enough, guys. Come on. Ninety. That's looking better. Yeah. Okay. Good. Yeah. 
Yes, okay, that should be enough. More than enough, even. So we lost 23%. That's, again, okay. Temple Knights didn't kill as much because we were only in calf combat, to be fair. Black Uruk Halberts, again, killing a lot. Just overall, decent battle there. Decent, decent battle. So that means we have taken Tirithoros with the Witch King of Angmar. I'm not really the Witch King of Angmar. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, it's the Witch King of Angmar. To be fair. Agendowers. I don't know. Something else? I have no clue, guys. Execute. Just occupy it. See, we can already do quite a lot with it. Get that trained. Let's you go and spy on Baradhan. Very lightly defended. Very good. They are sending more troops over. Less good. Okay, awesome. Can we train any more rations markets? Not quite sure if that would do much, to be fair. Hum, 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 hum. Let's just save our money there. But Largir has got a temple of Melkor. Good, good, good. Our thing is going up. Faction announcements, recruitment report. Baradur has trained some Ologai. Awesome. And them there as well. Moranon has trained a lot of troops as well. Okay, no one is coming to do stupid things with me. Pretty sure we could probably put those guys better in the fort. Not with those guys, I guess. Q stalled, yes, yes. So that's another nice settlement over here. Um, I hope we can do this without being killed. Plop down some watchtowers. So we've got some nice vision going there. And he can go on and take Baradhan, I think, with his army, probably. Maybe give him some pikes. Okay, good, 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 good. We are doing well here. I don't think these are real retrains. Get a temple of Melkor there first, probably. Because we probably can already train tr good, tr good troops here. Yes, we can already get the barrack, uh, the black Uruks here. So you should definitely use that to our advantage. Did we get the... Yes, we did. Get your ass down here. And end the turn then. Do we have military access with Khan't? Because then we can walk through their lands and uh, just attack Baradan unexpectedly. 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 Unexpectedly, yes. Those are the correct words. How long have we been going? 49 minutes. I'm not quite sure what's, what his idea is, because he should not go to Karasast. Yes, Sauron, don't worry. We will get you sooner rather than later. Yeah, sure, get it in Brethel now. Where is he? He is in Baradur. Send him to the front line as well. Retrain some troops. Can even train more troops there now. Sure, what does does to be fair. Oh, okay. 
Okay, need slave hall there. Yeah, okay. Colin has got a road. Not quite sure if we need a chieftain's hall there. Karasas has gotten that. That's good. Then, did they get them here as well? No, not yet. Oh, Temple Marksman! Yes, guys. Can finally start training those dudes. More Olog highs. Good, 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 good. Let's see, are we... Do we do have military access, so then we're just gonna cut through the, their land and just attack Baradhan that way. That's a good move. Were we doing anything else? No. <laughs> Orc hunters? No, thank you. If I could get a spy up here, though, that would be great, to be fair. Can I get a new spy? No. Does Tiridoros allow me to get one? No. Okay. Um. So then we have to go and see. Spy in Lebanon. Spy in Lebanon. Spy in the Merland Cap. Spy in the Riverlands. I think this guy is a bit unnecessary. No, this guy seems a bit unnecessary. Yeah. Let's get him up, up here to scout. The surrounding lands. Okay, so we've got 3k lying around. I'm um, gonna need some archers in the army as well. Ooh, it's what the a troll catapult. Okay. Okay. Probably should get that sometime. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Can he retrain that guy? Yes, he can. Need more archers, need more of this. Basically, you need more of everything, to be fair. Oh, yes. Gonna uh, get a new great army over in Brethel. If we can. We should be able to. If we have all of these guys and all the guys who are coming in from here. Let's get you guys over to... I mean, that's Morgul for retraining, which because you cannot be retrained over here. Neither can you. Get you over there as well. Ah, uh, pa 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 pa. And am I gonna leave it on that? No, I'll do another round turn for you guys. They are having. They have so many troops around Lin here. <laughs> My god. It is kind of scary. <laughs> really hope the audio is doing well again. Quite sure what Captain Bragven is doing over there. Being a dummy. That's what he is doing, I think. Yeah, he is. He's being a dum dum. Yeah, yeah, so Ron. Wait, 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 wait. <sighs> Not necessarily. Linden has been raised. Oh, that's never a good sign. Depending who you ask for, because in this campaign, we love it. Uh, I get a boar breeder. Doesn't do much, to be fair. But Temple of Melkor. Dark Temple of Melkor. Yes, thank you. Moranon boar breeder. Get uh, nothing there, I guess. Okay. You, uh, your ass to the front line as well.
Ehm, Moranon, Moranon, Moranon. Morgul, Karasast. Oké, Berethel. Get that. Then get that, then upgrade. <laughs> One unit of Corsair Archers. I hope they s l uh, get rid of the their troops in here, though. Ooh. Definitely need to get rid of those guys. Is it enough? I don't think it is enough. No. Ah, let's just merge them. Those guys are still fine. Everyone else can also go back. I'm gonna send those guys back to Minas Morgul for retraining. Come guard, practice range, thank you. Cue that up. We're building on every settlement over here we can, right? No waste, let's get it. Now we already get everything. Let's get that then. Get a Brin. Archery range, I guess. Ah, ba -ba -ba -ba. Yeah, okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Ready. This way. Ready. Now I need to make sure I can still see you, Baldan. Oh. No. Yes. Ah, I didn't move my diplomats. Why do I always forget to move my diplomats? Oh, never mind. I did move him. Okay, they're mounting attack. They're mounting an attack. We will need reinforcements over there to hold them back. As in there, as in Tirithoros, of course. Come on, guys. Keep it. Pay attention. Pay attention. My, my head is so sweaty at the moment. My god, it's horrible. Gondor is doing interesting movements. They're gonna not team up. Okay. It's my laptop making all that noise. My god. This guy's suffering from the heat, guys. Like us. Like us humans, you know. It's basically it's a, if it's like humans, you know. The host of the Eldar. Okay. Not necessarily yet, guys. Come on. Oh, that's interesting. They also hold that summons. Only we had some ships. I can listen up. Come on, or get one of those guys there and there and down there. Get ready for fighting. What? Where are you going that way? Get your asses down there. We have completed cannon. No sleeping here. Or Let's get you down there as well. Any guys who's been retrained can also go down there to make sure we have enough troops there. Make sure he gets the... What? That's... no, no, no. Character reset Gorthak. Um, let's just do it like this. We just get the, this army down here to help. This way, we're of course never going to be able to. Uh, oh no, did the hail. Oh, they hold this as well, Merlons. Okay. 
They are much bigger than I expected them to be. Credits on them, of course. Cast us. It's already gotten everything that it can. I got a catapult maker. Palar Gear Slave Quarters. Good. Um, yeah, we're gonna need uh, this. And Tiridor also got a Shrine of Melkor. Oh, he's just got barracks though. Get you that. Ah, the spider was moving up here. Yes, yes, yes. Awesome. He is going to check out. I don't know. I don't know what settlement to be fair. We have with the ruin. Yeah, we have the access. That's good. What troops are trained? They need more pikes, I think. And then we have a quite a good army, ready to go. Can we train anything interesting? Ballista Maker Monan is also quite good. Get something economical as well. And that should be it for this turn. Okay, well, I guess we can just move here and see what happens here. Ah, how about we just move to Goal Merland and then use this as a bargaining tool to give it to Radnaim. That's a quite smart thing, I think, to do. We've got every one of those. Ooh, another great beast. Oh, never mind. It's already in here. I knew that. These guys aren't all that expensive, but the Grace Beasts are, so let's get them in there. One more time, I'll end the turn. I think. Yes. I can I cannot stop, guys. A bit of a longer episode because it's my wedding day today. Well, the day it comes out, of course. <laughs> well, good. They've um, stopped bothering. They have stopped bothering Brethel. That's good. They're just being annoying at the bridge over between Brethel and Casas Gondor, but they will be dealt with. Whenever necessary. Which will be in the next episode, of course. Oh, that's a... Oh, those are big armies. Woohoo. Rather not have them at the moment at Territoros. If we could. Middle in, ru in ruins. Yes. Karasant has been besieged. Don't sleep in here. Come on, get ready for fighting. Come on. We have completed mission. Yeah, 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 everyone's going there to do their to do their thing, you know. Not really necessarily working on the new army here, though, are we? No, not really. Could do that, of course. See, that's already a basically a new army gone. Uh, Western Osgiliath. Can train a lot now. That's good. Maybe some more economic stuff then. There goes our money again. What else are we training here? How many arches do we have now? We've got like three. Uh, I can boost that a bit. Two more. Ah, uh, one more is also alright. Oh, it's oh no, it's Imrael in there. Oh no, 
Okay, well, anyway, guys, I am going to leave you on this sort of cliffhanger. Not really. We took Theridoros today. We're marching towards Cobble and Merlon, giving that to the Radnaim to make sure they get more in the fight. Then we can see Western Herondor. They also hold that. No way. They're so far in. That's a thing. Honestly, props to them, you know. We're going to have to deal with a lot of Dwemeroth in the future. And we are preparing a huge army over here to go and take the ring wherever that might be. I'm not quite sure anymore. If you can le leave it in the comments where it was last time the message popped up, then that would be great. For now, guys, I am going to leave you here. And I am not sure when the next video will come out, but you will see that when you see it. For now, have a great time.